EDC Inc. is a beautifully designed series of ultra-portable writing instruments, designed to always be with you and ready when inspiration strikes. These Go Everywhere pens are designed to be super compact and fit on your keychain without even noticing. EDC is the acronym for everyday carry and is a popular topic of discussion regarding the need to always be prepared. A pen is one of the most useful items to have with you at all times. EDC Inc. makes this easy with its simple, rugged, compact, go-everywhere design. From filling out forms to jotting down items on your to-do list, EDC Inc. allows you to always be ready, even without thinking about it. Like a meticulously crafted watch or handmade pocket knife, these precision machine writing implements are a joy to use and handle. As a designer, it's my job to come up with new ideas, and being ready to write them down or sketch a fleeting idea is crucially important. This need led me on a search for a pen that would always be with me and not a bother to remember or too big to carry. Nothing I found really suited my needs, so I decided to create my own perfect go-everywhere pen. The EDC ink pens are designed around the standard D1 refill. This compact refill is available just about everywhere. I will be supplying these pens with my favorite refill to sketch with, the popular and amazing Pilot High Tech C. It is ultra precise, smooth and dries fast, which is perfect for us lefties. The refill is also very easy to replace without the need for any special tools. EDC comes in two sizes. The smallest pen and the one I carry is the X1. At only three and a quarter inches long, it virtually disappears on your keyring. While the X1 is a bit small for a lengthy writing or sketching session, it's perfect for capturing an idea or filling out a form. X2 is slightly longer at almost four inches and would be better for people with large hands that plan to do more writing or don't mind carrying a slightly longer pen. After creating these pens for myself, I began to receive interest from several people that saw them and wanted to know how they could get one. It takes me about five hours to make one of these pens, so I decided to design them for mass production and try to make them available to everyone that might be interested. Producing them in larger numbers will dramatically reduce the overall cost and allow volume discounts on raw materials as well as the ink refill. So that's why I'm here. I'm hoping there are a lot of people out there that love these pens as much as I do and are excited about this project. I really won't be able to do it without you. Thanks a lot for watching. We decided to design a multi-tool that combines all of our favorite features into an ultra low profile tool that we call the titanium pocket tool. This new tool is made from aerospace grade five titanium alloy. Despite its minimal name and appearance, this new pocket tool is extremely versatile and lets us do more and carry less.
Hi everyone, I'm Aaron. And I'm Amy. And we're back on Kickstarter with our latest innovation, the Apex Tactical Pen. At only 4.7 inches, Zero Hour Apex is one of the smallest tactical pens around and guaranteed to survive extreme conditions. Apex explodes standard pen designs with a rugged, ventilated body that reveals the unique brass cartridge inside. The Fisher Space Ink cartridge is the most versatile refill ever made. It can write in zero gravity, underwater, at any angle, and through severe temperatures. Use the tungsten steel tip to break glass for self-defense and for light metal and tool engraving. Apex is available in aircraft aluminum with a smooth matte black finish or upgrade to our polished grade 5 titanium. It's perfect for everyday carry on your keychain, in your bag, or in your pocket, and tail stands when you set it on a flat surface. When you get home or to the office, Zero Hour's custom pen stands complete the look and are made from the same indestructible materials as your Apex. Our first two projects launched a great success on Kickstarter and have been featured on the Today Show, CNET, and Discovery Science channel. Apex continues our mission to offer quality tactical products using premium materials, and we'd like to thank you again for your continued support. Thank you. Hey, I'm Nate Barr, creator of the Pocket Monkey, here today to tell you about my latest creation, Wildcard. The pocket knife needs to evolve. It's an essential tool, but it's bulky, it's one more thing to remember in the morning, and it easily falls out of your pocket and is lost. I wanted something better. I asked, why not put a pocket knife in my wallet? It'd be easier to carry and harder to lose. So I set out to design a knife that'd be as thin as possible, and the result is Wildcard. It's only two millimeters thick, only slightly thicker than a credit card. I was able to do this by reimagining the blade pivot. Most knives have a pin pressed through a hole. Wildcard has a pivot unlike anything in the world. I call it fly-off technology. The three wings of the pivot allow the knife blade to remain rigid to the body, a necessity when wielding a sharp tool. For safety, I designed the blade to lock open and to lock closed. The blade tucks neatly under two blade guards, and it angles only on one side, so users can't accidentally cut themselves when carrying a closed knife. And here's the best part about this design. The blade is detachable. I designed this with the forgetful traveler in mind. When you go through TSA with your traditional knife on you, you lose your knife. But with Wildcard, you only lose your blade. And on our website, you can replace it for only a few dollars. With Pocket Monkey, I used a monkey to represent the personality of the tool. With Wildcard, I kept that trend going. Wildcard has a wolf cutout that doubles as a bottle opener. The wolf embodies the nature of the tool, agile yet powerful. I wanted to pack as much functionality as possible into Wildcard. Many people misuse knives in place of other tools like screwdrivers and pry bars, harming themselves or breaking their knives. So I added these tools to the knife. I always wanted to challenge convention. Because of that, I spent the last six months trying to reinvent how this product is manufactured. Every manufacturer I talked with was hesitant to produce such an aggressive design. The solution I kept hearing was take this to China, but that isn't something that I'm willing to do. I want to create products that embody the American spirit of innovation, and my solution was to create a manufacturing facility in Maine. Now we control every aspect of production, from laser cutting to packaging and shipping, so we can manufacture the highest quality product while creating jobs in our community. Help us make Wildcard a reality and help us continue the American spirit of innovation.